Hello, my sweet babies. I hope everybody had a great Easter yesterday. Um, all right. On the blessing board for April, Miss Francis, Miss Stacy Snore, Miss Annette Allen, and Tazalyn Silvercat. Shout outs Cosmic Carol Creations, India Brady Art, Art by Me by Andrew Walker. Naptime Creations, Tanya Beecher Wood Turning, Tea and Art, and my baby Christopher. Hey, darling. I know it's been a while. I'm so sorry. But I love you, and I hope you have the blessed day today. And thank you for watching, darling. All right. On the prayer board, we have Snake, Snacy. Uh-huh, Snacy. Stacy Snorf and her mama. And her niece, Bryna. I'm hoping I'm saying that right. Miss Rose and her mama. Miss Annette and her mama. Miss Vicky. Um, <clears throat> Miss Vicky had to have physical therapy, so let's pray that that's working. Miss um, Bonnie Davis. Her husband is having open heart surgery May the 31st. Uh, his name is Mr. Floyd Davis. So let's send prayers to Mr. Floyd and and um, let everything turn out great. Okay. All right, Sophia and the PKS family. Levi the Miracle Warrior on Facebook. Miss Robbie Ivy. And my mama and my sister. Thank you so much for all your prayers, sweet babies. And I love all your comments. Oh, my God. I've got to catch up on my comments. I've got to catch up on my videos. <sighs> I'm still feeling iffy. Uh, and I probably will for a long time. But I can't just sit around and I'm starting to get sick in my stomach a lot. So, i got to get my, my, my mind occupied <clears throat> with other stuff. So, what we're going to do today is we're going to make a planner. Oh, I wanted to say thank you all for using my affiliate links, too. Y'all are so sweet. Um, my less resin coupon codes, Miss Francis, I think are working again. They finally got in touch with me. I've been working with Miss Bessie, and she said that they are working. So, uh, let me know if y'all use my less resin affiliate link. And use my coupon code and it doesn't work. Okay. And um, everything that I'm using today is going to be linked down below. We're going to be making a planner box. I've seen this on Home Talk. I'll have to look up the video so I can give the lady the shout out that she deserves. I will link it down below in the description. Thank you all for your prayers. I can't say that enough. Y'all don't know how much that has helped. Um... For my family, for the uh, loss of my daddy. And uh, let's get started, okay? All right, I went to the dollar store yesterday. First, I went to my daddy's grave. I wanted to go make sure all the flowers were there because it came a storm like two or three days in a row. My goodness, it's been storming. <clears throat> and I just wanted to go make sure everything was still where it's supposed to be. And it was, except for the flowers that goes on the top of the grave. They have blown away, but I think I've got them staked down good enough now. All right, but anyhow, after that, I went to the Dollar Tree, and I found these doggone little, what do you call them, crates? Uh, they're not crates. What are they called? Pallets, pallets, wooden pallets. I was shocked at my Dollar Tree. They had uh, uh, some stuff in there that I've never seen in there before. Okay, this right here just peels off. Y'all bear with me, please. I, I'm probably going to stutter a lot. <laughs> so anyway, I'm using um, shoe polish to stain my... I was going to use varnish, and I was like, oh, God, this is easier. It's got the sponges. But this is... Um, shoe polish comes in three in a pack. Dollar Tree. I've used it before. So give it a good little shake around. And we're going to get to staining. Now, I've got these two. Now, these were just the um, 
drawers. I think I put the doggone things up. Did I? Yeah. These were just slid into this box. Now, I was going to use that, but that's just too big. So, I'm going to be using this one. Okay? The drawer. Alright. Now, what I'm going to do first is I'm going to take my brown shoe polish. Let's say brown. Probably don't say nothing. But, tan. And I'm just going to give this a little stain. Okay. And, um, All right, and then what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna leave that like that. Now we're done with this, done with that. Now I'm gonna take a little black, and I want to um, make it look like it's got, um, I like it's old, and I'm just gonna dab on the ends. If you get too much, it doesn't matter, honey. Don't matter, babies. All right, now I'm going to take a baby wipe and I'm going to just wipe some of that off. Okay, just like that. And that's that. Look at that. Looks old. Mm hmm. It's like it's been there a while, don't it, babies? Okay, now then I have prepared the other four. Now, what we're going to be doing is we're going to be hot gluing them together. Now, this one don't look as dark, but maybe because this one's still wet. I just did it. Okay? But it's going to go like this, just to give you the gif of it. Just to give you the gif. Like that, we're going to put a planter box here. Planter box here. Where's my other one? And a planter box here. But first... I want to stain these just like I did the wood. So I'll be right back, okay? All right. I got the boxes all stained. I did the same thing. I did it in brown, and then I went around the edges with the black just to make it look old, you know? Now, you don't have to use this side. You can put the flower side down and just use it. Put you a design on there if you want. Just like that. Look. Let's put it together so y'all can see it. Flower side down. Now, mine's going in my kitchen window. So, um, I'm just going to be spraying it with water. I'm not going to be pouring water in it. But if you want to put um, your herb, make an herb mop. You could put more here and make your herb garden. Um, just take your Dremel tool or a ice pick, hammer some holes in the bottom. There you go. Seal it first. Seal it. Seal it with this first. And then water is not going to bother it. Okay? So, what I'm going to do next is I'm going to hot glue and wood glue these together. This is a uh, super glue wood glue. And I'm um, going to put some on the side. Oh, crap a dap. Yeah, 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 yeah. Let's do that. Where's my baby wipe? Wanda, Wanda. Y'all hold on, babies. Lord of mercy. Bear with me. Mm. Bear with me. Mm -mm -mm. It just jumped out of there, didn't it? Oh, I got me two more cutting mats. Two come in a pack. Honey, it's great. If you're working with glitter, these are great. It's just a plastic cutting mat. Glitter slides right off of it. So, yeah. All right, now then. I'm going to put a little bit. A little bit. Right down through here. Then I'm going to take my hot glue. And I'm just going to go right over the top. Okay. A little bit on the feet. All right. And we're going to stick them together. My hands are shaking, y'all. I'm sorry. I hope I get it even. 
and you're gonna just hold it there for a second until this this um, hot glue uh, I can X this off if you want until this hot glue does what it's gonna do now I got some clips but I'm not sure I got these clips but they're not um I think you clip the ends together like that just to make sure now then we got those two okay and we're gonna do these two all right oh crap I think I cut my hole too big that's what I did get off all right now hot glue a little bit on the feet and then I'm just going to come right on top of it. Okay. Move that out of the way. Lay this down. Push them together. Just like that. Wipe off the excess. And get two more little clips. And I'm going to let it sit there for probably five minutes I mean hot glue it don't take that long to dry so we got that now then when I come back oh mercy look at it oh it's stuck to my finger dang when I come back we're going to uh, glue and hot glue these together okay I'll be right back Okay, so I'll dry now. On the ends, I'm going to go every other one with wood glue. And then every other one with hot glue. Okay. Alright, and now we're just going to dry and get it even. Okay, I'm going to take my baby wipe and wipe off. Excess. Look at that. Get off. Get off. Good God. All right. Now we're going to let that sit until the hot glue gets what it's going to do. Okay. Just going to hold it for a second. All right. Now then, I've decided I wanted to decorate the box. So I have cut out, I got these from the Dollar Tree. They're chalkboard tags. Um, chalkboard tags. Six come in a pack. Okay. I'm going to cut out a circle with my handy dandy little cutter. That should be good. All right. Now, let's get this cut. Just stick it in your little thing in there. No rhyme or reason. Just poke it in. Push down. Alrighty, now you slide this open and you get your little tags out. And I have three. So, I'm going to be putting them on here because if y'all are like me, honey, I, I'm going to forget what I got in this box. In this herb box. It's going to be, I think I'm going to do herbs. And there's that one. And that one. Make sure the flower is on the back. What did you say? Okay, now then, if you want it to look pretty, this Marabou Alcohol Ink Rainbow. Let me show you something else. Honey, I'm just, I just do extra stuff. But anyway, I think it's going to be pretty. So I'm going to get me a, like a little hard brush. And I'm just going to put me two or three drips on there. I know y'all see it already, don't you? Let me hold it up there. Look at that. Just spread it around. And that's going to give you some prettiness to this boring black um, like that. See? Is that a little sparkle? What? Alright. And we're going to put that on there. With some super glue. I'll be right back. Alright. 
Got all of them with their little chalkboard tag and alcohol. My blue ink rainbow. Now, we're going to put blue glue around the edge. Oh my God, Wanda. And hot glue. A little bit of there and a little bit of there. Mainly I want on the corners. Okay. Now, pick it up because I want it even. I'm going flower down and I'm going right up here to this corner. Now you can you have a little time to wiggle it before your um, what you call dries. Hot glue. Wipe off the excess on the side. I know y'all can't see that, but now we're gonna do the rest. Be right back. Alright, there it is. Now, you do not have to stain it. You can paint it different colors. Do whatever you want to do. This is just how you make your base. Do whatever you want to to your pots. Okay? Now, y'all remember when I got the lavender and the cactus um, kit? So, what I'm going to do is take this out. It's got this little, I guess it's supposed to be dirt. Okay, and uh, I'm just going to be sitting this up up in here. Look at that. Look at that. Yay! Cute little pots. I tried to find one more because I knew I was going to have three on here, but I couldn't. So I'm going to put the um, lavender up top and the cactus here. Okay, so let me read the direction and see how you're supposed to do this, and I'll be right back. Okay, it says dissolve medium pellet in one teaspoon of water, fluff with fork, and place in pot. So, we're in the art room. I don't have a fork. So, what I'm going to use is this here. I'm just going to use that. Okay, so one teaspoon of water. Uh, we'll put it off up in there. And I'm just going to squirt until I think it's a teaspoon. All right, that should, that should do it. Now we want to fluff with fork. I guess you got to soak it in and let it get all good. Oh, yes, yeah, sucking up that water, baby. Now we're, oh, better work something. Now we're going to fluff it. See this? I can need a little bit more water. All right. This video is probably going to be long. That's okay. If y'all don't want to see this part, just fast forward, baby. A little bit more water. Wish I could have found another one. That would have been great. But they didn't have any. I don't know why. And I was looking in the garden. Oh, look at that. Hey, that's a lot of dropping it. That's a lot of little dirt. See how this thing just, stuff just comes right off of it. I love it. Dollar twenty-five babies for two. Can't beat it with a stick. Alright, so we're just going to keep going until we get our dirt all chopped up. A bit more. Honey, it takes more than a teaspoon, okay? It's one teaspoon for sure. Just chunk it up, it says. I'm going to pour what I've got already in the pot. Okay, now I can work with this. Alright. More water. Let it soak for just a little bit and then chop it up. Look at that. Teaspoon of water in my butt. Put more than a teaspoon, didn't it, babies? Sure did. Okay. You 
you get it wet enough and it just comes apart. Okay, there we are. And we're going to put our little soil, that little bitty pellet made all of this dirt. Let's get it all over there. Look at that. Wow. Okay. Here we are with our dirt. Now, what next? It says... Use sowing info table below to determine how deep to plant your seeds. Sow seeds and lightly cover with growing medium. Cover pot with plastic wrap. Place in a warm, bright location and keep growing medium moist, but not overwatered. Remove plastic wrap once seeds germinate. Once seedlings develop their second set of leaves, begin watering and plant fertilizer mix at half strength. Oh, shut your mouth now. So what I'm going to do, take my little thing here and just make a hole. Just make a few holes. And I think I have plastic wrap behind me. So, I don't know how many seeds is in this little pack here. But we're going to see. Now. Alright, here we go. So what we got? Lavender. I think lavender smells so good. Come on here. Let's me in there. Oh, crap. I'm going to pour them in my hand. Look at that. A, bit, a little, little bit. Alright, now what I'm going to do is just sprinkle. Sprinkle. Sprinkle them in. Now I'll do the cactus um, off camera, okay? Now that you know how to do it, now we're just going to cover them up. Make sure they're all covered up. Now, honey, honey, babies, this is the first time I've ever done this, so hope it works. If I see some, I'm just going to poke it down in the soil. I think that's going to be it. Alright, there we are. And there's our lavender. Now I'll be back when I get um, the cactus done, okay? All right, there we go. Now, I got these on here. Now, what I'm going to do is I'm going to put the lavender up here, and I'm going to put the cactus down here, and I'm going to try to find another little something to go in there. So, I got my chalk pen. This is a chalkboard thing here, and I'm just going to put lavender on here. Because if I don't, I'll forget what I got in this pot and cactus. I don't think that's all right. God, cactus. Yeah, all right, I don't know. But anyway, here we go. We've got it all plastic wrapped. Put the lavender in there. Put the cactus in here. And there goes your little plant stand. Is that not cute? And look, it stands up. So you don't have to worry about it tumbling. So I'm going to go put it in my window and... Uh, if it ever quits storming, get some sun. I wish I had a heat lamp that I could put it under, but I don't. So, there you are, y'all. If y'all like this video, hit the thumbs up, please. That helps me so much. And all my affiliate links will be down below. Um, if you would like to sponsor my channel, my PayPal is down below. Um... I appreciate it so much, and I love y'all. Let me raise you up. Talking to the pot plant. I love y'all, and thank you so much for all your prayers and your comments. And I promise I'm going to get caught up on my comments and 
and my videos. I've just done got so far behind. I appreciate y'all so much. Y'all are the best YouTube family ever. And God bless you all. And y'all have a blessed day. And I love y'all so much. So much. Peace, love, prayers, and happiness, babies. Bye. Lord of Jesus, I forgot to show y'all what Miss Annette and Miss Stacy sent me. Lord of mercy. Oh, my God. Okay. Let me get it together here. All right. Look at this. Oh, my good Lord. Look at this. Look. Miss Annette made this. Oh, my goodness. Look. Is that not beautiful? Oh, I'm going to set it by my bed, and every night, I'm going to light a candle for my daddy. Yeah. Thank you, Miss Annette. That is beautiful. I, I absolutely love it. I'm going to leave it right here because I'm fixing to put it in there. She sent me some candles to go in here in the angel. She sent me some magnets. Look at these. Is that not the cutest freaking little bear you ever seen? Look. Aren't they cute? They're going on my refrigerator. I think they're adorable. Or on my stove. I may put them on my stove. I'm going to leave those out too. And I um, haven't opened this. So I don't know. Oh my goodness. Come on, baby. Oh, wow. Look at that. <gasps> Look at the pink. Do y'all see that pink? Oh, that's gorgeous. That is beautiful. Oh my God, that's gorgeous. It's got a pink hue to it. Look. Oh, Miss Anaya. Little heart. Ain't that pretty? I love that. That is so pretty. So I'm going to leave that out. Okay. And uh, let's get all this. This is what Miss Stacy made for me. Y'all look at that. Heaven has gained a beautiful angel. Now, she made this for when my Aunt Sue passed. Y'all know. Remember when my Aunt Sue, two months ago actually. Um, so this can be for my Aunt Sue and my daddy. Mm -hmm. And that's that that Miss Stacy sent me. And she sent me these. Now, I had to text her. And she sent some uh, Easter ribbon. I've already put it up there on my, it's right here on the end. Let me show you. Let um, me get up there. It's right there. Uh oh, right there on the end. Easter ribbon. And she sent me a metal truck. Now, I put my metal truck uh, in my to-do thing over there. Because I want to make a mold out of it. Now, this is like a mold housing thing. Thank you, thank you. And you do it like that. I had to... Wait a minute. That's not right. I had to um, message her. Message her. Messing. Messing. I don't know what I'm trying to say. But anyway, you put it together. I, uh, I don't forgot again, Miss Stacy. Lord Jesus, help me. Um, I don't know. But anyway, it goes together. That's not right. Uh, like this? No. Yeah. No. That's not right, Wanda. Anyway, I had it together. But anyway, you can make it different sizes. Whatever size you need. Put your mold in. Now, um, I'm going to be doing those crosses. Remember the crosses I got from Mama's? Look at there. You can make it any size you want. That's not right. <laughs> That's not right. Okay. That's not right either. I don't know. I had it together. Now, I can't remember how. But anyway, the flat side goes on the inside, of course. Okay. I'm thinking less yet. That's good. I may not just have it in there right. 
There we go. Mole housing. Look at that. Any size you want. Any size, honey babies. Is that not cool as a fan? Thank you, Miss Stacy. I love it, baby. And she sent me t-shirts. Oh, honey baby. Look at this one. Look at this one. She sent me three t-shirts. Look at that sugar skull. Oh, ain't that gorgeous? You can't really tell. It's got orange in it. Let me cut this light off. Maybe, maybe that's what it's doing. It. Is that not beautiful? Oh, I've worn the other two. Um, so they're dirty. But I'll show y'all them on the next video after I get them washed. Thank you so much, Miss Stacy. I love it all. I love it all. Thank you, Miss Annette. You are so sweet. Y'all, y'all make my heart full. Let me read this beautiful card to you. It says, thinking of you during this difficult time, may your heart be filled with warm thoughts and treasured moments of your dearly departed. With love and deep condolences, Miss Annette. And then she wrote me a whole beautiful little thing over here. I love it. Thank you. I thank y'all so much. And Miss Tazlin, she's on the April blessing board because I haven't used the mold that she sent me. Okay? So that's coming up, y'all. I got a, a lot of catching up to do. A lot. And I'm gonna I'm gonna try my hardest to stay focused. Talk to God. And uh look at that. Oh my God, look. I bet y'all can't see it like look, can you? Look at it. Oh, it's beautiful. It's different colors. Red and pink and yellow and blue and green. It's gorgeous. I love it. Thank you so much, Miss Annette. Thank you, Miss Stacy, and I love y'all. And I almost forgot about our prayer card. Do our prayer card. And let's not forget to say prayers for everybody on the prayer board. Okay, darling. All right. Let's get us a prayer card out of here. And see what our message is for today. All right. Here we go. Set your mind on things above, not on things on the earth. Amen. Colossians chapter 3, verse 2. Set your mind on things above, not on things on the earth. Mm -hmm. Thank you, Jesus, for that message. Thank you. All right, darling. I'm going to go. And I love y'all very much. And I appreciate y'all watching. And I'm sorry that um, it took me so long to <sighs> get back in the swing. I'm not 100% in the swing, but I'm I'm coming. I'm coming. I feel it. I feel it. I'm coming. I'm getting a little bit of comfort and peace from, from God. And 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 y'all, with all your prayers and your comments, and oh, I will see y'all on the next video, babies. Y'all stay safe, and God bless.